all know I probably use the stock crappy spool holders we get from most printers. And because I have a heated enclosure, I had to get rid of mine. So I built a new one that I'm going to share with all of you to print and try out yourself. And this is what you're going to need. You need a 6mm drill, number 4 hex head, then you need your soldering iron. To make sure the holes aren't too tight, you want to drill them out to the 6mm. Just like this. Once that is done, you take your insert, your soldering iron, put it on like this, and start melting it into the project. Just like this, ever so slowly. Once you've done that, you successfully have added threads to the sidewalls. Then we are going to need a bearing. These are roller skate bearings. And to make them fit, I have included some spacers. You just push them in. You take your M5 times 20. So I have made the holes a bit too tight. And just like that, we have a spacer. You take all apart. We have our perfectly centered bearing. You can push over your roller and you're good to go. Finished one side. Now this is what we end up with. So we got the four spool holders. We got some nice multiply. Now I'm going to make some borders using this piece of scrap surrounding the whole vicinity so we can pour everything up with some nice silica gel. Now we have a nice place to pour in the desiccant. But before I can do that, I forgot one thing, and that's to put in some heated inserts right in here. So I'm gonna do that right now. The holes are ready, now it's time to put them into my enclosure.
while it's all working perfectly the only thing that I didn't do very well is placing the heater right in front of the spool holder so now they have the full blast full heat and it's PLA so I put on some aluminium tape to reflect the heat and that seemed to help a little bit so you might want to put some PEG in this instead of PLA plus but would I do it again absolutely I can place eight spools I just have to pull them down in the heater cabinet they all have their separate leads into the enclosure I just have to hot swap and yeah it's super handy so thank you for watching guys I hope you liked it download it share some pictures with me let me know what you think about it and guys I see you in the next one